Hi, this is Barry J. McDonald here and I'd like to welcome you to today's episode from rightcom.com and today I want you to take a bow and the reason I am saying that to you is you know for us that are writing or creating content, making videos, writing books, coloring books, whatever it is that you're doing, blogging, whatever it is, you know sometimes we don't actually give ourselves credit for what we do you know the the fiction writer that's puts out a book you know at the chance of having it being slated you know who goes back in again then and writes maybe a second or a third book you know who's constantly working on their craft it's you know you imagine you're like somebody like a boxer just sticking out your chin and you're just begging for somebody to hit it you know it's the blogger who shows up every day who's writing blog posts who's scouring the internet looking for knowledge that they can share with people you know, it's somebody who comes along and puts out YouTube videos every day, you know, creates content where in maybe the next five or ten years they're going to look back at those videos and they're going to cringe at the content that they're putting out or the way they come over on camera or, you know, how poor their videos look. But right now they're doing the best that they can. And sometimes we don't give ourselves credit for that. You know, it's easy just to keep plodding away and plodding away. But, you know, when you're stuck in your own kind of, when you your blinkers on and you're, and you're working in your own lane, you know, it's sometimes it's it's... You know, you need to take a look at outside it. You know, all the people who would love to be in the position you are and just haven't got the courage to do it. You know, all the people who are going to go to the grave and never write a fiction book. You know, all those people who say, oh, I'd love to have a, an income working from home. And, you know, they haven't got the courage to write a blog post. You know, even you know, even if you're the worst blogger in the, in the world, you know, even just writing one until you get a bit of experience on your belt. You know, they're, not, they're afraid to take that because they're afraid to, you know, make mistakes in the very beginning because they feel that they have to put out the perfect, you know, content straight away. Same with the videos. You know, there's somebody who'll say, well, I can't make videos. I don't know how to do it. Uh, I'm afraid how I'm going to come across and, you know, it's going to cost me a whole lot of money. I need to do all these green screen backgrounds. I need to do these intros and outros and all these different things. And they keep holding off and they don't do it. Whereas you have people like yourself and myself, you know, who do that, who, who put their chin out, you know, who say, well, you know, this is the best that I can do today. You know, when I think about it, when I think about some of the books that are still floating out there somewhere, you know, people are still buying them and create space and, you know, maybe have them in their libraries. And, you know, I cringe at some of the, the spelling mistakes I made and some of the, you know, grammar choices or whatever it was, and I can't get them back. But at the time, that was the best that I could do. And, you know, when I think about it now, you know, I congratulate myself on having the courage to, to do that, to, 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 you know, to, even though I didn't purposely set out to create bad content, write bad books with poor storylines or whatever, you know, I had to get the ball going. I had to, you know, like a car that's broken down, you have to put the, the biggest effort in to get a push in it. And the majority of people don't actually do that. They can't, don't want to do the hard work. They want to kind of come in and jump in the car when it's freewheeling down the road and, you know, everything's hunky dory. But for a lot of us that are kind of, you know, every day doing the same daily grind, whether it's writing emails, whether it's, you know, content creation, videos, whatever it is, you know, I think you should, you know, congratulate yourself on doing that. Because the probably, the majority of your family probably looks at what you're doing and says, you know, that she's crazy, she's not making any progress, or why is he doing that? Look at he's in fool, and all the neighbours and all the friends are going to see his videos on YouTube, and they're going to laugh at him, and oh God, I'm so embarrassed, and all this. And, you know, I, I congratulate you for for having the courage to do that because that's what the world needs. They need people to step forward, to be courageous, to, you know, turn their back on what everybody else is doing and going on their own path. So today, take a bow, pat yourself on the back, or whatever you want to do to treat yourself because doing what you're doing is making a big difference and the world is a better place because you're doing it. So my name is being Barry J. McDonald. This has been today's episode over at writecom.com. And if you'd like to come over and find out some of the more great content we have on the blog, whether you want to sign up to or subscribe to our YouTube channel, or follow me on Instagram. You're very welcome to do so. And I look forward to see you, seeing you on any of those platforms. So take care and have a great day. And more importantly, give yourself a pat on the back and take a bow. Bye-bye.